Black Ops 1 on the DS. To be more specific, Call of Duty Zombies on the DS. Yes, you are seeing correctly, Zombies mode was actually on a portable device that isn't a mobile device because there is one more different version of Zombies that you can play on your iPads or tablets, but that is discontinued. So this is the only version that we have that is portable and ancient. So as you can see here, we have four maps, house, facility, temple, Overlook, which have all of their special kind of like descriptions and in today's video We are going to try to play every single one and just see how challenging zombies is on a DS Now I will be making a more in-depth video on all of this and one thing you have to do bear in mind is I don't know if you're supposed to play this with a stylus I am missing mine as you can see here I did lose it a very long time ago, but it is playable with just a DS now This is a very old model of the DS as you can see I have only like what these to work with and yeah you are supposed to move with them and that's about it 3ds's have way more options and more things and this is a very old ds so i think it just kind of enhances the experience but what i prefer to do let's hop right into house and see how challenging this zombies experience is you get actually loaded in super fast just because somehow there's super really fast loading times and it's as you can see quite interesting so you move with these and these and you shoot with the normal triggers, you aim in, you aim down, and it kind of makes everything really annoying and difficult. The movement is uncomfortable, and I know there's probably methods of basically getting this game, essentially using it as like a PC build of the game, but you just play it on the PC with better controls. I think the whole idea of playing it on the DS just makes this so much better. Oh, one scary thing is, and I will probably show you an example when I do die, uh, okay, this is gonna be some rough gameplay. I'm in, I'm in a pretty uncomfortable situation while recording this video, but if I- come on, come on. There we go. Sorry, hitting my camera. Oh god, oh god, we got this, we got this. Come on, there we go. Um, yeah, some of these buttons do stuff. I don't know what this one does. That one does something. Uh, this one just like makes you turn around really fast. This one is a grenade. Um, as you can see, I'm holding a grenade. Let's just toss it. Um, this one is the knife. So yeah, you can just run around with the knife. You don't have to, you know, just knife zombies. We're out on round two. It's called waves in this. What I was going to say is you kind of just, you, you, you die super fast when you get hit by zombies. Uh, I'm playing with no sound because I don't know how to record with this kind of an ancient DS. Uh, one issue is they never seem to come from this side, I noticed, like ever. But zombies, like it's... Well, that's what happens when you get hit by a zombie. I have no idea where he was, but he was somewhere and he hit me. So let's try that one again. Okay, we're back on the map. And what I want to at least do is show you the mystery box. I have to <laughs> I have to earn 5,000 points. So I'm going to try to uh, not die. I don't know if this has any connection to normal zombies universe in the Triarch universe. It is made uh, like obviously it's a Black Ops kind of port. Oh, here's actually a drop if you can see it. Uh, that's a nuke. Whoa. Wait, how did I do that? I don't know how I did that. I activated a nuke, but also I knifed them somehow. There's still a lot that I'm learning. Oh god. Oh no. Where's the zombie? There he is. There's just a lot happening. <laughs> oh, that's an insta-kill. Come on, can I get it? Oh, there we go. Collected insta-kill, as you can see at the bottom. This has been like a version of the game that I've wanted to play for such a long time, but I was just kind of like, ah, eh, what's the point? And you know what? I'm so glad I did. This is definitely something that I should have, oh, insta kill. I should have checked out such a long time ago. And there's just one more version, as I mentioned earlier, the iPad version that I would love to play of Zombies. Now, we are supposed to be getting ports of, uh, I, I've heard from leaks and rumors of like Black Ops 4 onto the Switch. Um, I don't know how that's gonna go. But also there's rumors of a brand new like Nintendo console coming out and there's possibility that new Call of Duties are just going to be coming out on that. So we'll have portable zombies and of course you do have like the Steam Deck and other portable devices now that can play zombies. But you know this is this is as old and ancient as legit as it gets. Okay I'm, I want to buy this wall by but like what am I supposed to do? There's like hand stuff. Grab it. There we go. We bought the wall by which just like ate up our points but. Uh, 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 
Ooh, max ammo. Does that refill my ammo? Of course it wouldn't. We did it? I actually don't know. I wonder what the highest world record round is on Dia Zombies. Probably nothing too insane because this is a bit of an uncomfortable experience. All right, we hit that 5K. Let's buy this door. Wait, why can't I buy the door? <laughs> no, you're not killing me. I'm gonna get like arthritis by playing this mode. Okay, let's do this. 5,000. There we go. New place, and what I want to show you is this. Look at the mystery box. The mystery box is just like a weapon case. <laughs> Wait, did <laughs> I actually never used the mystery box? Did I just give it to me straight away? I guess we have an AK 47 now. I don't know if there's a packet punch. Uh, I haven't played that far yet. Where's the zombie? Where's the zombie? Why are you showing me there's a oh, oh, no, is that a sprinter? What? Well. I guess we died. Okay, just not to spend too much time on, like, maps. Uh, we died. I showed you the box. I don't know how to pack a punch in this game. Uh, but that was the AK-47. And now we're on a different map. It's called Facility. Kind of looks like the same. <laughs> kind of looks like the previous one. But that doesn't matter. Uh, we have this, which seems to be a door. I've never went upstairs yet. So, I guess, let's just try to buy the first door on every single map. That seems like a interesting challenge to do if you've played this like ever what what do you think of it i'm planning to also like play the multiplayer and the campaign on this and probably make it all into like a big chunky video where we're just gonna look through every single thing and be like this is black ops ds blah 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 now obviously i keep mentioning the ds version of the game but there is the ps vita black ops declassified but that doesn't have zombies so that's why i'm not really like crazy about it i might get it and try it out depending on like if you guys enjoyed this video and i am trying to manifest my way to somehow get access to that ipad version of call of duty if you guys do want to see those as videos then you know be sure to comment down below be sure to uh subscribe and especially drop the like on the video that will definitely notify me if you guys enjoyed this all right we have five thousand points actually let's why are you walking sideways okay we have five thousand points let's buy this let's go upstairs what's up here moment of truth Oh, a lot of stuff. Oh, 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 this is a big map. Oh, we have the box. I wonder if these maps came out as like DLCs. Give me the box. Give me the box. I don't have enough, so don't give me the box. There seems to be a lot of stuff. Is this another door? Are there more doors in this? Oh, what? 10,000 points? How the hell am I supposed to do that? <laughs> what? How are you supposed to get 10,000 points on this? Oh my god. They want me to go through pain. I mean, I'm kind of tempted to try to get it, I guess. Uh, but we won't be able to do it with this gun. Can I? Can I? Oh, they gave me the AK-47 again. Um, Is that box just called random weapon? Is that what boxes are called? Random weapon. That's what I, that is. I collected a nuke. I collected a nuke. Where? Where? I. I. Why? Let me check my stats. So we have 21 kills. Two power-ups picked up. Oh my god, am I going to get the world record for the highest round on DS Zombies? Am I going to jinx myself? Oh god. I <laughs> Let's just move on to the next map. And here is Temple. Uh, Temple is a bit of a... Yeah, map. I also didn't play too much of it. So I guess this is going to be my full experience. It's a pretty small area to have to walk around so like this is all i have like right here that's it the other places you had like other rooms and other stuff that you could walk around but that's okay uh i think this is a reasonable size also from what I, my understanding is this is like the first time we have i don't know which zombies but the zombie models that are in this are like the only time that we've ever had zombie models like this now i know it's kind of uh funny to say that because obviously these zombie models are very different from anything that we've seen, like, <laughs> with the pixelated looks they have. But these specific ones, they have, like, the hats and the guns. Uh, oh, there we go. There they are. Oh, ne never mind. Now, my hand is killing me, so for a grown-ass adult who is, uh, you know, has ginormous hands, this game definitely isn't something that I would play for countless hours. Now, if I was younger, which I doubt this was intended for younger audiences i would be gaming this like 24 7 because it is actually fun like i won't lie it is a fun experience it's just the zombies experience you just go on try to beat your pie round it kind of makes me enjoy it because like when i go to play other zombies maps how did i do that see like i, I don't know 
how I did that, but I knifed a zombie again. Teach me game. Don't just do it and then make me try to figure it out. Somehow I'm capable to knife them and I do not. Is it double? No. Double just looks like a weird quick scope. But I'm having fun playing this and I'm definitely enjoying it because it's so goofy. Um, we just died. Um, and here we're going to test out the last map. I know I didn't go to the psycho room. It's just, oh, that's a, that's a bed. That's some spider webs. Sorry, I don't think I've actually played this one. And this one, it just seems to be a lot of rooms. A lot of rooms, you know? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, please. Please spare me. Oh, that was surprising. Oh, dear. There they are. There's the some bamboos. Oh, 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 oh. Pro skills. Pro gameplay. Pro gameplay. You'll never see. Oh, my God. Can they stop coming from this one room? Please. I'm scared that they're behind me. See, I did it again. I did it again. I did it again. And I don't know how. I don't know. Seems to be a zombie somewhere. <laughs> oh god, that is terrifying. <laughs> Seeing the marker, it is terrifying. I think this is the door we have to buy. Yeah. If it was less points, this would be easier. Getting 5,000 points is such a pain in the ass. And then 10,000? What do they think? I'm just, I'm rich? I mean, it is zombies. It is just some points. These wall buys seem to be in weird spots. Oh, also, this is the other one that's just the, what is this gun called again? Oh, I guess once you have it, you never get to know. Now, one thing I'm curious is about is, what is this? Huh? That first supposed to be for like a secondary? Is there a way? Oh, I forgot. There's like. <sighs> oh dear. Controls. Button control. Blah, blah, blah. ADS icon. ADS. What? These are. Are these controls? Is there more information? Button layout. Oh, aim, movement, fire, <laughs> ADS. Anything else? <laughs> There you go. There are the controls. Very, very simple to understand, as you can see. Can you see me? Am I somewhere? Have, have you been jump scared by me? Sight mode. Select aim down sight methods to stylus controls. Yes, yeah, so I feel like this would be so much easier with a stylus. ADS auto lock. Wait, is that just aim assist? What does that mean? That I'll have like aim assist? Or did I turn off aim assist? Because I'm pretty sure aim assist was already on this, I think. Oh god! I tur <laughs> I turned off the ADS aim assist. Well, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that was Black Ops Zombies on the DS. Just a little bit of a fun short video to check it out and how it was playable basically so long ago. Now, again, my DS is super tiny. Like, my hand just... It's like a phone. I ha my phone is bigger. Now, I have the iPhone XR, and as you can see, it is bigger as you can see it is quite quite bigger not by a lot but it is definitely bigger so it's basically like playing a mobile game but also on top of that not to mention the ds screens are tiny so they're not even the size of the ds so for an adult you know it is what it is but it is quite fascinating to see that pack ops was on the ds and as you can see here it is like all the box stuff survive the zombie horde alone or with a friend or two-player co-op i guess there's online two-player only i don't know if the online still is there if you want to look at some of the art here it is whoa i'm so good at this vroom, vroom. oh god i hit my camera so yeah, that's going to be for the video if you did enjoy it in any kind of way be sure to subscribe be sure to drop a like on a video as that does really help out and we're on the road hitting 50 000 subscribers we're not too close but we're also not too far away so consider subscribing if you want to see more goofy videos like this just checking out well i guess if you even heard of black ops zombies or black ops on the ds before and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one peace out thanks so much for watching